In today's video, we're gonna be opening the brand new Konami set, the first Yu-Gi-Oh set of 2023. In today's video, we're gonna dive straight into amazing defenders. Without further ado, let's begin. What is going to your boy Sam from Team Zamrex when you hear it? Happy Wednesday! Guys, today is the official release day for Amazing Defenders for all OTS stores. I'm going to be completely honest, guys. Um, Amazing Defenders right here, I don't think it's a crazy set. There are some better sets out there, but it's still pretty amazing. Let's see if we can pull some crazy cards out of this, okay? I know there's Amazing Collector's Rare. Uh, in this booster box right here. So right now at the time of recording this video, if you guys check out TCG Player, which you guys can use my affiliate link in the link in the description box below. If you guys wanna help support out your boy, you guys check out my affiliate link in the link down below to get all your Yu-Gi-Oh! TCG needs, decks, cards. You guys can check out my TCG Player affiliate link in the link down below. Right here, as the time of recording this video, the most expensive card in this set as we are currently speaking is a one for one collector's rare. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, is around $124, which is insane. So 100, 125 bucks. Rescue Ace Impulse, right? So we got new Rescue Ace cards. Absolutely amazing. We got Rescue Ace Impulse right here. Inferno Noble Knight Roland, Machine Dupe, Gizmak Oroshi, and Mikano Kagura uh, right here. So we got a new Ritual deck, a new Xyz deck, and a new Rescue Ace deck, right? So I want you guys to let me know in the comments below, which is your favorite? Out of the three archetypes, okay? Which one is your favorite, okay? Let me know in the link down below. We got Peerly's, we got McConnell's right here, uh, which is insane. Uh, Saravis, the Ancient of Ascendant, McConnell Purification Dance, reinforces the Army, and of course, Card Trooper. Card Trooper is also a collector's rare as well, which is actually pretty crazy. Don't know how much this card is as a collector's rare, but you know, we, we get a rarity upgrade uh, for Card Trooper, which is not that bad, not that bad. Here we go, we got Contain. Uh, right here, contain. We got McConnell Rivalry, Hidden Armory, pretty awesome. <gasps> right off the bat, we got a collector's rare, bro. Holy smokes, we got a rescue ace hydrant right here. This card right here is around $70, $69.99 right now on TCG Player, which is absolutely insane. So, guys, ridiculous, absolutely ridiculous. This is crazy. Oh my god, so let me let me sleeve that real quick. Sheesh. Guys, Supreme Pro Sleeves, the best sleeves in the entire world. If you guys haven't gotten them yet, make sure you guys get it today in the link down below. These are the best playing card sleeve, TC sleeves, you guys will ever see in your entire life, I promise you guys. The best sleeves, really smooth shuffling right here. It's literally better than player's choice. Get the sleeves today. I'm confident you guys will love them. And it's also my entire website right now for all sleeves is buy two, get one free. So you guys buy two sleeves, get one free. That goes for the over sleeves and also for the border sleeves as well. So guys, buy two, get one free. What is this card, dude? Why do you control rescue ace monster out of the rescue ace hydrant? Your opponent cannot target this card for attacks. Also, your opponent cannot target this card with card effects. You only use each effect a rescue ace hydrant once per turn. You can activate a quick play spell or trap card that was set by the effect of rescue ace card. The turn it was set. During your main phase, you can add one rescue ace monster right at your hand, except for rescue hydrant so this card right here is literally a, a, a continuous uh, straddles when it's on the field because every single turn you get add cards and it's absolutely insane so this is definitely like the main card in the deck for for sure this card is really really cool wow right off the bat we got a collector's rare already x pearly happiness honestly guys these boost box smell absolutely incredible x pearly x pearly happiness what is your favorite archetype out of this set guys rescue ace airlifter inferno white durandal Hari, the Sword Mercano. Okay. Amazing, amazing. Smell absolutely incredible. Next booster pack. Guys, I'm just really shocked I pulled a collector's rare like right off the bat like that. Exceeds Im import. Ex Pearly Noir. It's like a Pokemon archetype, bro. So it requires two level sevens. You can also exceed this card by using a rank two monster control with five or more materials. This card's effect by your opponent activate card effects while it has five or more materials. You can have two control from this card. Like one card your opponent controls when you grab plays on the bottom of the deck. Pretty cool. Pretty cool archetype. Alright. We got Arn Protector Dragon. Perry's Reese map, Overlay Regen, Regen, Overlay Regen. Wow, this card's old. So target one XC's monster field, attach this card to it as material. This card is really, really old, bro. All right, we got a next booster pack right here. Come on, come on. Rescue Ace Fire Attacker. Preparation of Rights, Saravis. <gasps> My friend, apparently. You can pay five lot points. You have three probably cards on your deck, except for one of them. Your opponent randomly adds, picks one and adds it to your hand. Also, travel the rest of the deck. This field XC's monster control leaves the field because of your opponent's card. You injury damage step. You can add three pearly quick play spells with different names from your graveyard to your hand. Card's amazing. The fact that this card is a continuous spell makes it really, really powerful. Purely happy memory. Okay. Purely happy memory. Purely. Makano Fire Dance. Absolutely amazing. Gizmek uh, Naganakei. The Sunrise. 
Makano Purification Dance, Exceeds Tribal Rivals, and Gizmek Aroshi, the Serpentron Sky Blaster. Great common reprint, by the way. Let's get it. Let's get one for one, guys. One for one. Let's get one for one. Can, can we get two collectors rare in, in Ooh, Inferno Knight Ronaldo. Amazing. Can we get two collectors rare in one booster box? Next booster pack. The Great Makano Ceremony. Expertly Beauty. These cards are cute looking cards. Kind of look like Pokemon, to be honest. Like EV Evolutions, if you guys were to ask me. Okay, Contain. We got, of course, Stray, Purely Street. Isolde, Two Tails, Normal Knights. This card now comes as a collector's rare, which is worth around $78 right now on TCG Player. I'm pretty sure the prices on these cards will 100% cool down as a set, you know, equalizes. But right now, all the high prices, you know what I'm saying? Like, cards are very expensive. Rescue Ace, HQ, Harry, the Sword Meccano, Roland, Rondo, Purely, Purely Eep. And Gizmek Orochi. All right, next pack. We got Preparation of Right. Nini, Demiro, uh, Meccano. Cute, Exceeds Reborn, Meccano Rivalry, Exceeds Tribe Rivals. Tribal Rivals and Sacred Sword of the Gizmek Legend. So Gizmek reprints right here. I don't think there's any like significant crazy reprints as collectors, right? Like we just see Card Trooper and Info Normal Knights. We got Gizmek. I don't see anything crazy, crazy other than one for one. Rescue Ace Attacker, Rescue Ace Airlifter, Purely Delicious Memory. Rescue Ace Turbulence is the main card of the deck. So what does this do? So you can bash two Rescue Ace card in your grave. Special this card from your hand. In your main phase, you can set up the four Rescue Ace. Quick place all trap cards of different names directly from your deck. Wow. If another card you control leaves the field by your opponent's card or effect, you try one card on the field destroyed. This card is insane. This card is good, bro. What the heck? Literally, like, rescue ace cards are insane, right? Rescue ace airlift. They're one for one. There you go. Super rare. Okay, where's the rescue ace cards? What the heck? Set up the four rescue ace cards directly from your deck. That's a little bit insanity, isn't it, guys? Contain. So this card's an effect builder for sure. Fire engine. Amazing. Extinguish. If you control a rescue ace monster, this card right here is a, is, is a pop. That's insane, bro. So we got a negate, which is a veiler, and we got a pop right here. So it sets up to four. You set one of these cards right here. Kind of reminds me of Runix. Where you have like one of each interruption, right? That's really, really cool. HQ. While your opponent controls a monster, all rescue ace monster you control gains five attack and defense. For your main phase, you can normal summon rescue monster and it's normal summon or set. Once you target four rescue ace cards that are banished from the group or shuffle them into the deck and draw a card. It's not a quick play spell. So you can't, you, unfortunately, you can't set that. But you can set the normal traps. What other spells are there? We got, of course, Ohime. The man, uh, the manifest is Meccano. This card is a ritual card of the deck. So you can ritual summon this card with Makano Kagura. Cannot be destroyed by battle. Also, your opponent takes any battle damage you have taken from battles involving this card. You don't use the falling effect Ohi Ohime. It manifests Makano once per turn. You can reveal this card from your hand. Add one Makano card. Redact your hand. So it's a straddles. And then discard one card. Quick effect, you can equip one equip spell from a graveyard. Give it to one appropriate once in the field. So this deck is an equipped deck. Wow, that's insane. Okay, Xyz Import. Purely Reese Map. Expertly Plump. Makano Promise. Extinguish. Spirit's Blessings. Rescue Ace. Fire Engine. These cards just smells delicious. All right, guys. We put collectors there, so I'm really, really happy. One for one again. McConnell Reflection Rondo. Never know more XC's Tribal Rivals. All right, guys. Two more packs to go. Here we go. Purely Happy Memory. It's purely Happiness. Hidden Armory. Double Edged Sword. Hard Trooper. And McConnell Kagura. What does a ritual spell do? These cards kind of look like dual avatar cards. I don't know. You can use this ritual summon as any, any McConnell ritual monster. Okay. You must also tribute monster for hand or field whose total level equals to exceed the level of ritual monster. Short cards opponent controls up to the number of equipped spells with different names in your graveyard if you do. Wow, this card is pretty lit. Last pack, guys. Last pack of Destiny. What are we looking for, guys? What are we looking for? I'm just happy to smell the cards, to be honest. Amazing defender, guys. Amazing defenders. All right. Arm Protection Dragon. Contain. This is the effect veiler. Rescue Ace Monitor. This card is normal summon or special summon. You can add one Rescue Ace Trap from your deck to your hand. And when your opponent activates a monster effect, you can tribute this card from your hand or face on the field. Carry one Ace Monster Graveyard. Special summon it. Wow. Card's insane. Makano Promise. Ismek Nagani. Of course, Extinguish. And we got Spirit's Blessing. Thrown off for the last and final card. So, guys, that's pretty much it for this amazing Defenders opening. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. We pulled a Collector's Rare for the very first set of 2023. This opening was absolutely broken. really hope you guys enjoyed. What is your favorite archetype? Is it Rescue Ace? Is it Purely? Or is it Makano's? Let me know in the comment section below. It'll be absolutely amazing. This is your boy Sam from Team Star Sam signing out. Happy Wednesday, guys, and I'll see you guys in the next video. All right. Peace.